Good morning. I can't tell you how excited I am about today. I'm at Disney Springs. I decided to explore uh, what is it, Flavors of Florida Festival or events. They have a lot of good things. I wanted to try everything, so I brought my family with me because I can't eat all the, of that stuff, but so I needed some help. So, um, you might hear some voices in the video. You're not gonna see them, but you might hear some other voices that do not belong to me. I'm going to be putting on my mask now. Masks are um, mandatory again, which makes me very happy. I know a lot of people don't like that, but I was still using my masks even though it wasn't supposed, not that I wasn't supposed to, even though that um, it wasn't mandatory, but I just feel safer that way. So I'm happy that they are back. So we're gonna be matching with my daughter. Um, I wanted to show you that I'm carrying this bag. It's an oldie but a really, really goodie. And this bag I chose because I was going to be matching with my daughter. So I got her one from Primark that matches this one very well. I wanted to show it to you so you might see her back. Turn around, baby. All right, this is it. You see that? Gorgeous, right? So we are matching. The other thing I wanted to show you is I'm wearing the um, t-shirt from Target that I showed in my, one of my previous vlogs. It is a little see-through. It's not terrible. It's not horrible. I did size up and I do suggest that if you do that, you size up. But if um, a little bit of see-through is something that you can tolerate, that you don't like, then stay away from these ones and go for the ones at Disney World. Those are thicker. Um, that's it. Let's go. Let's go eat. Let's go have fun and eat These are the options. I mean all these and the ones on the back. I posted pictures of it um, Yesterday on my Instagram in case you can't see it well here. Um, I Think oh, I don't know where to start Honestly, I'm feeling like this um, Yeah I don't know, I guess I'm just gonna walk around and depending on what I see, we'll stop there and look for uh, for items, right? Let's go. Chef Art Smith's Homecoming is the first restaurant that we came across. So I think we're gonna try that. I mean, I don't know if they are sitting people right now. We're, we're actually right now in line to see if they have a table. I got Team Tracker's poster. All right, let me show you uh, the two options that they have here. So one is food and it's Gator Bites and then the other one is a cocktail. I don't drink alcohol. I was thinking about maybe ordering one um, from the many options that they have here just to show it to you guys. But uh, the truth is I don't enjoy drinking cocktails that much. So yeah, I think I'm gonna pass at least on this one. Here you go, Gator Bites. I have never tried this in my life. If I'm honest, when I read the menu and I saw that they had Gator Bites, I was like, nope, I'm gonna pass on that. But um, I'm with someone brave enough to try them. Actually, he said that Gator Bites are really good or Gator is good. So I'm, I need to smell amazing. So I'm thinking, for the love of YouTube, for you guys, I'm going to give it a try. Alright. I don't know how I feel about this. This is what they look like. It comes with um, some like homemade sauce. It looks creamy. I don't know if it's spicy. I'm hoping it's not. The other one is hot sauce, so I'm not gonna try that. Um, it's very hot though, so I'm not sure if I should wait for a little bit. I'm just gonna risk it. I'm gonna uh, put a little bit of that sauce. You can see it there. Okay, it won't focus because my face is in the frame, but here we go. It's true. It does taste like chicken. Like chicken thighs. Okay, it's not bad. Yeah, I would recommend this one. I actually tried the hot sauce and it's not that bad. It's not that spicy. Obviously, it does have a kick, but it's not that bad. If anyone is interested in the price, that was $15. 
The candy cauldron is the next stop. My daughter is very happy about this. They have some cupcakes that I will show you in a second. Actually, I just noticed they have cupcakes, marshmallows, and Rice Krispie treats. Key lime and strawberry flavored. So these are the cupcakes. I'm not sure if all three options are for the uh, festival. They also have Rice Krispie treats that look like uh, key lime pies. This is the strawberry one. And then these are marshmallows covered in white chocolate, key lime and strawberry. This is what we decided to get. So we're gonna try the strawberry cupcake. It does have some jelly on the top. Uh, we're gonna cut into it in a minute to see what it looks like inside. And then this one is the key lime pie. We also got the key lime pie, uh, or not key lime pie, just key lime marshmallow covered in chocolate. It does seem to have some graham cookies uh, on top. And then this one is a Rice Krispie treat and it has uh, something, I'm, I'm guessing it's like crushed cookies or something um, strawberry flavored I caught it just to see what it looked like inside it's not filled with anything um, but now it's time to try it this is gonna be very messy I'm not really sure how to do this but here I go mm. 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 this is very nice Mm, I'm not typically into cupcakes, but the flavor of this one is very nice. It's also um, very soft and moist. It's a really good one. All right, I think it's time to cut through this one. I'm more excited about this one than the other one. So I got the strawberry one because it was pink, so my daughter wanted that one. But this is the one that I wanted to try. I really love key lime flavor and key lime pie and stuff like that. Uh, it's very hard to open it with one hand, but I think you can see there that it does not have any filling whatsoever. All right, I'm gonna try this one. I really want the ear. Uh, it's chocolate. Love, love the sprinkles. They're Mickey's. Um, uh, how should I do this? Uh. Mm. Mm. I don't know. I'm a little disappointed in this one. I think the strawberry one is a lot better. But it all comes down to taste, so maybe you'll like this one better. Who knows? Oh, it's time for this beauty now. Let me show you what it looks like on the back. Okay. They said that it didn't have any chocolate, but I think it does have some chocolate covering it. I don't know. Let's try it. Oh. Hmm. Mm, I do like the flavor. It tastes a little bit like... I don't know. It reminds me of something. Is it Fruity Pebbles? Or is it? Ooh, ooh, Captain Crunch. Captain Crunch, you know the uh, like the strawberry ones? Is it strawberry? I don't know, there's a red Captain Crunch. Or is it? Is it Captain Crunch? <laughs> I think so. It's good. It's good. Let's try the other one now. This pretty guy is what I wanted the most from here. So, ooh, it's time to try it. Let's see. You always start with the ear, right? And I think this one on this side has more um, graham cookies. I mean, they should have given us more, I think, but whatever, I'll take it. Hmm. Mm hmm. I don't feel a lot of key lime taste. Hmm. It's okay, I'm gonna say pass on this one. We are now at City Works Eatery and we got the, what's the name, uh, grouper tacos. This is what they look like. Now, I request, they come seasoned with some like Cajun style seasoning. I requested uh, them to like use it sparingly uh, because I don't want it to be too spicy for my daughter. It also comes with fries and this plate is $22. All right, it's time to try it. Mm. Oh. 
Oh wow, this is really good. It is still a little bit spicy. Just a little bit. If you're very sensitive to that. Um, I don't know, maybe this is not for you. But honestly, I'm kind of sensitive to that. And this is good for me. Guess where we're going next? This is one of the places I wanted to go the most. And it's time. Here you go. Here you see this beauty. And this is what it looks like in real life. And I am a dying to try it. Now, this one is not part of the Flavors of Florida um, event or festival. But this is what my daughter wanted. So why not show it to you? Um, price. This one was $6.50 and the sprinkles one was uh, $4.50. Look at it inside. Oh, it smells so good. It smells very key limey. Well, um, guys, I don't love it if I'm honest. The feeling is too tart for my taste. But maybe that's something that you'd like. I think I forgot to mention that the uh, grouper tacos that we just had at CD Works were absolutely amazing. I do recommend that one very, very much. This one, not so much. Looks like Hello finally opened. They opened late. I have been waiting for that because uh, their selection seems amazing. This is actually my first time here in this restaurant. I, I want to come back and eat like from the regular menu. But for now, since we are touring Disney Springs, um, I can't really get anything else. I'm already super full with uh, what we've had and we've been sharing it. Um, I think that's the way to go if you want to tour the uh, Flavors of Florida, how can I call it, festival event. Anyway, I wanted to show you the view. I'm not sure if the camera is picking it up uh, the same way as my eyes are, but I get to see the, uh, the balloon. I was hoping they would put it to work, but it's raining, so I really doubt it. Right, in case I hadn't shown you the description, this is what we got. That's the picture, and this is what it looks like in real life. Uh, it smells good. It looks amazing. It has some like mashed potatoes on the bottom. I think there's like an orange reduction or something like that they said. Uh, these are pieces of orange and I think she said it's topped with some like potato chips or something like that. So let me cut through that and uh, give it a taste. Alright, alright. I want a little bit of everything. So I need that. Let's see if I need a knife. Uh, I may need a knife. Well, maybe not. Maybe not. All right. And I want a little bit of this. Ooh, it's exciting. It is very exciting. Let's see, let me turn the camera around. This is it, the moment of truth. Oh wow, oh, from everything I've tasted today, this is the best thing ever, this is amazing, if you can only get one thing, if you don't have time to go around and eat and try different foods, get this one, fantastic. Look at that price, wow, I was expecting it to be a lot more, it's $14. I'm blown away by how good it was. Absolutely recommend it. You have to try it. Loving this place. Loving it. This was my first experience here. I definitely need to come back. It's time for chocolate. We're gonna get this guy right here. Oh my goodness, look at this! Oh, that's gorgeous! I don't want to touch it because it's COVID times, but... And you know, like, no, baby, don't touch it! <laughs> and uh, yeah, that, somebody's gonna eat that, so I'd rather not touch it. But that's gorgeous! Okay, found it. It's this one. It's $6.50. We're gonna get one to try it. We're gonna get the very first one. Lucky winner. Now this guy looks like it's inspired in the new movie, the Jungle Cruise one. This is $28. Says it's a milk chocolate sphere and it has marshmallows. Oh, it says a uh, wild mix of marshmallows inside. Looks interesting. 
and I found the Minnie Mouse version. They're super cute. This is a uh, 650 classic milk chocolate. Oh, the Mickey Mouse one. It's strawberry ganache chocolate pop. It's also 650. It is time to open this beauty and give it a taste. I am so ready for this moment. Um, it's dark chocolate, so I don't know. I wish it was uh, milk chocolate. Well, let's see. Mm. 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 Wow. Oh, this is amazing. It tastes like uh, like key lime pie. The um, inside part is super creamy. Let me turn the camera around because it's not gonna focus if it sees my face. Um, it doesn't really wanna focus on it. I wanted to show you a close up of what it looks like inside. It's very creamy, kind of, uh, not exactly like the consistency of key lime pie, but kind of. And this is our last stop. We can't eat anymore. So we got the key lime cheesecake shake. That's the picture of it. And this is the beauty in real life. Oh, can't wait to try it. And since we're celebrating the flavors of Florida, obviously, I gotta show you this guy. He is new, Big Feet, and it is $29.99. He is adorable, isn't he? Oh, how cute. Oh, wait, somebody had asked if they had extra small in the t-shirts. Um, I'm only seeing small. I think small is the smallest size that they carry here. Are these new? I don't know. I don't remember seeing this before. The set is $19.99. And look at how pretty these are. So you get bows and also in hoop form. And then Mickey Mouse. Um, the Mickeys are silver tone. And then the hoops are black. But the Mickeys that are dangling are also silver toned. And then the hearts are red and the hoops are red. Oh, this is gorgeous. I feel like this is a bracelet set that I had already shown, but I'm not 100% sure, so just in case. So the first one says a dream and it has the horse, like the carousel horse charm. The second one says wish and it has a charm with the castle. And then the last one says fantasy and it has uh, the clock. Let me show you the small world one. Now, um, one of them, dream is pink, wish is purple, and fantasy is green. This is a beautiful set. It is tan. What does that mean? $19.99. This other set is also new. This is the first time that I see it, so I'm sure I hadn't shown it before. Um, this is very interesting because they are more like rubber. I thought they were going to be uh, plastic beads, but they're not. They are like rubber. You see that? So the first one has a Cinderella shoe charm like that. The pink one has Aurora's crown. And then the green one, uh -oh, the green one here, has a genie's lamp. This set is also $19.99. Guys, you remember when I showed this dragon long time ago when the movie came out? I tried playing with it because it does say try me and I tried everything and I couldn't make it work. Well, my four-year-old made it work in like 20 seconds. <laughs> Baby, can you make it work? So apparently you just touch it <laughs> here. I think that's it. I think that's all you have to do. Oh, that's so pretty. Uh, again, the price for this one, it's, it's $19.99. Calling all donut lovers. Isn't this gorgeous? This is super pretty. Oh, it says BFF on the charm on the side. Three different necklaces. So I'm guessing you keep one and you give the other two to your friends. The set is $24.99. You know what guys, I haven't seen this backpack in a while, at least two weeks. Haven't seen it at the parks, haven't seen it at World of Disney, haven't seen it at um, Ever After, nor the co-op. 
what happened? Is it gone for good? Or are they just waiting to restock? I've only seen the wallet and the card holders. My mind is going crazy. I think, is this new? I feel like maybe I've seen it before. I feel like maybe I showed it in, a, in another video. Uh, not that long ago, but I'm not entirely sure because if I did, why don't I have it? <laughs> this seems like something that I need to have. How much is it? $19.99. Ooh, I love it. How about this cute Pizza Planet earrings? Uh, do you see the glitter here on the red part? And at the top, the planet is blue. Um, it, that's plastic, but still looks super cute. These are $14.99. $27.99. This bottle of water is new. And I like the gang there. Is it focusing? I think it is now. Then they also have this other one. Mickey Mouse looking cool as always. Is it also $27? Yes, $27.99 for that one. Let's take a quick look around the mugs. This one says, I need a fast pass to Friday. It's mad and inside it's a beautiful peach color. This one is $14.99. Then this one is also new. Walt Disney World with all the characters. Love how creative this is. This one is sparkly blue inside. You see that? I don't know, is the camera focusing on that or, or capturing that? It's like glittery. And never too old for fairy tales with Tinkerbell there. This one is like metallic green inside. These are very nice. Oh, this one at the top here is also new. Pink, it says love. It's very shiny. I'm gonna say it's kind of an iridescent finish, but not not quite. And it's the same color inside. $14.99 as well. Guys, I thought both of those mugs were Disney Store mugs, but they have them here now, and they're $14.99 here. Can't remember how much they are at the Disney Store, but here they are $14.99. This Mickey Mouse one is so beautiful. It has a silicone lid. And let me see the price $19.99. But this is not the only character they have. Let me show you the other one. This is the other guy, Donald Duck. I thought I would see Minnie Mouse, but they don't have her. I've only seen these two characters, not sure if they're gonna bring out any more. But this is super cute, isn't it? And then there's this other new mug. It says, Unlock your imagination. It has the fireworks. And on the back, it has Mickey Mouse. Gold, uh, kind of like gold foil, but I don't know. This is more, it's a little bit more matte than what I would consider gold foil, but maybe it is. I don't know. Not an expert uh, when it comes to those terms. And then the spoon inside has the castle there. Can you see that? Uh, hopefully, it'll focus on that. Let's see the price $19.99 for this one. We're tired obviously we've been here all day but we had a really good time we got to eat so many good things I hope it helps you when uh, planning your trip the flavors of Florida is going to be or the options are going to be available until August 12th so it's about to end but if you're coming in the next few days or maybe if you are in the area now um, you might be able to have an idea some of the options so I hope that you like this video and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!